or I should say Terra. I've just been doing some back and forth, just around. I think I showed this off before, but I got a storage room with all my different types of stones and stuff, and I got some calcite and all that around, because I figured it's getting to be quite a bit of stone I was gathering from digging up my pits. I've got a bit more supplies here than I've been also working on decorating the pit as well, since I knew it was going to be quite an interesting sort of thing if it was just going to be bland or not. So, I'm actually going to show you off what I've been doing for the... Well, I'll start from top down, since it'll be a little bit easier to show you off. Just tell everyone. Pit has been going quite well in terms of just just general design and all that. Because so, I've I've been struggling sort of with the design since I was like I don't know what exactly to go. Oh, there's a little crater here. Uh, oh god, I don't have my emeralds on hand. Huh. Oh, interesting. Slime would be useful in the cow ah. shop. Would be useful, but it's fine. I don't need it right now. But as you can kind of see, I've been slowly filling everything up. And actually, it'd probably be easy if I start from the bottom up. <laughs> yeah, at the, at the bottom here, I've been starting to work on the beacon, which is also another uh, geo down here. And I've just been slowly filling out each of the layers with just various designs and stuff with copper. It looks like some of the copper is starting to age, which is what I've been looking for. Because I think... Because I've been trying to find a use for this copper. It just... Honestly, there hasn't really been much use. And I just... Each layer is either a mix of either redwood, dark oak, or... Uh, mangrove. And then this layer is one of the biggest sections just because there's the geode here. <coughs> and I got... Obviously some of these pieces are not going to be producing as optimally like this piece here or anything like that. I mostly just wanted to leave this section open for most of the geode since those that want to collect it will collect it. And that's part of the reason I started that. And once <laughs> I am planning and working on a uh, bubble later soon enough, but I don't have the kelp for it quite yet. But yeah, I've just been slowly trying to fill in each of the things with the copper and planks, and then just sort of help divide the layer using the logs. Just in, just so be a little bit easier to tell, hey, this is a layer that it's for and all that. But I feel the spirits are in high hopes today and I am excited for that. Which I am sort of catching the tail end of s s someone joining in potentially. Sorry for the brief cut there. Just what I had something to do in the background, but got good feeling and gonna <coughs> just continue on this feeling that I happen to have and might as well just follow through on it, so to speak. Oh, I should close out of the map, but I did actually want to show off on uh, uh, to be fair I like I noticed it before but like I didn't fully realize that I was here until like got fully going around how there's this giant ravine like it continues from over there to all the way over here and there's a whole bunch of more honestly it's kind of crazy Ah. 
organized a little bit. Who is this? Oh, hello. Why, hello there. Honestly, I was just showing this off to some of the spirits that happen to be around. <laughs> didn't, mm. expect, didn't expect anyone to actually be in here. <laughs> Well, I woke up in a tree. I'm not sure how I got there. Last thing I remember, I was in one of my manors and, you know, fell asleep. As, as you do. Yeah, as one does, I suppose. I've honestly just been working on my pit, so... Which is just right a few, a few blocks that way, actually. Why are you working on a pit? I'm trying to set up a beacon. Do beacons have to be in pits? No, but to get the full benefits, it, having it farther down allows it to fully reach multiple layers. Hmm. At least that, I, that that's what I've read in the books, so... Hmm. Yeah, I've just set it up right over here. <laughs> I've been trying to decorate it, because I'm also going to be making a villager hall out of it as well. Oh my. Yeah. It <coughs> goes all the way down to bedrock. Mm hmm? Uh-oh. Um, wait a second, let me fall. Oh! Ah. <laughs> hey, stay close to me, I have weapons. Yes. Oh, what? There you go. Did I get stuck in- I got stuck in mud there for a second. Oh, that's yeah, that's one downside of kind of living in a swampy area, unfortunately. Hmm. <coughs> well, luckily I'm wearing boots. Yeah. <laughs> What's your name, stranger? The spirits told me that others would be showing up soon enough, but didn't expect when exactly. Sorry, I, I muted, just realized. Um, what, was, what was the question? Yeah, and I apologize, fine, I got fine. distracted. The, the spirits can be very loud. I, I know they, they can be very distracting. Um, I was just wondering, what's your name, stranger? Because, as I said briefly, the spirits often say a few things that there are others would be showing up soon enough. I just didn't expect when. Hmm. Uh, I am any, any. Oh my goodness! I can't speak my own name. Are that tired? Eniolia. Pleasure to meet you. Hopefully, I don't butcher that in the future. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my name is Tara Aria. Uh, uh. Okay. It's. Let's see here. It's, uh, sorry, I didn't say my whole name. Enolia Von Sapphire. <laughs> oh, it's a pleasure to meet you. Hmm. Indeed. So do you know how long you'll be staying in the area for? Um, <clears throat> you did not hear that fuck if I actually said it. Anyway, um... I do not know. Well, I'm hoping that one of my villas or manors are around here, because I have no clue exactly where I am in, in comparison. Well, we do have a small little settlement, so to speak, building up, while not fully designed for supporting people, so to speak. It's sort of just there for people just to kind of, like, relax and all that, if you want to follow me. And... Oh, that works. Mm -hmm. uh, do you have any... Do you have food on you? Oh, uh, yes. I have a little bit of, uh, snacks That's in good. my pocket. Well, if you'd like to follow me, then. Wait, give me a second. I can actually maybe make a day. <laughs> Can I unroll this? Backpack. Yeah. Hmm. One 
benefit of carrying a backpack. You always have a sleeping bag with you. <laughs> hmm, seems I should have probably <laughs> had mine nearby or... It's, uh, it's oh, over this way. Oh, wrong way. Yeah. I mean, Let's yeah, I've, I've been... Ouch! Oh! I've been holding up in this uh, building in here for a bit just because everything's already naturally protected and hard, it's hard for things to get through, but the mm -hmm. things that I've been seeing at least, there's... The spirits know that a lot of people just come together to play here, but... Or at least they like to say that it's, that's at the very least. Honestly, just sort of a nice little village, so to speak. Hmm. Oh, well, if anything, it'll be an interesting trip. Ugh. I haven't been out in the wilderness in so long. I forgot how sticky and things yeah. can be. Yeah, I, I've i been getting used to the environment. I've just naturally gone faster just because of it. Hmm. <laughs> now, I don't mind it, but I'm not nearly as, uh, in love with it as, uh, some of the wood elves will be on occasion. Is it all swamp here? No. It goes into fields. It just this immediate area of swamps. But uh, here hmm. is to the our I think it's our south here. Yeah, our north here actually is a village, and this is where the little game area, is, like as the spirits say, game area. And farther south of here is another small village. So two small villages surrounding sort of a bigger more fun area between the two, as some might say. Hmm. This, this one here is actually the one that the spirits made for me. What, like your home, or...? Yeah, just sort of like a place away from the place hmm. I set up and all that. Wait a minute. That looks familiar. Not at might. It did show hmm. up within the last couple of days, so... Oh, <laughs> yep. One of my villas, huh. But it seems like the spirits did somehow bring in with your horse for you. Ouch. Might be... Anyway. <laughs> yeah, it seems like the spirits did bring along one of your horses. Hmm. A decent horse, mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of people have been setting up sort of as a get to, like, getting up here, but in terms of, like, actual living, if you choose to want to stay around this area, I'm, most of the time I've been staying in this building over here, so, <laughs> the large tower that you saw. Oh, yes. Hmm. I could offer a few supplies if you'd like me to. Oh, there seems to be stuff inside of here anyway. So that should be good, I think. At least to begin with. Hmm. There's some small changes from what I remember. Hmm. But, not too bad. So, I see you might be at least a little bit like me in terms of potential heritage, maybe? Though, I can't, I can't 100% place your heritage from... Is it... Hmm. Draconic or demonic? Out of curiosity. Draconic. Hmm. Okay, so not not exactly the same. Yeah, my mine is, is yours. Yeah, uh, mine's the more, opposite. Yeah, mine's more demonic in nature, but though hmm. not entirely of my fault of nature or doing. Mm hmm. At least I think, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Mm. You would think by sleeping so much I'd be not tired. No, quite the opposite. You'll think, but sleeping <laughs> more you'll find that you get more tired. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so to say, be careful, don't turn off the edge. <laughs> <laughs> But the villagers are very friendly around here, at the very least. Hmm? Oh. 
I've, I've been talking to the mic quite a bit and making quite a few deals with them here and there for various supplies. Hmm. Well, it's good to know. Especially considering this is nowhere, nowhere close to where I, I originated from. That's for sure. It's too <coughs> swampy. Uh, I think that's just each ah. in the rain, probably. Oh yeah. That there's not like, you know, big buildings, a whole city, a town, even. Yeah. There's a village and the place that I saw, or I'm probably going to stay in that that villa, even though it is tiny. But it is mine, even if it's slightly changed. Hmm. I don't want to get too far ahead of you, just because I am a bit quicker. <laughs> Hmm. <laughs> you do have to be careful, though, because sometimes the spirits like to play a few pranks down then. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. Out of the spirits of the Fae, one of the two. Or both. Definitely don't want to make them angry, though. No, always... is that a penguin? It's, I th it's, they said they were a raven. <laughs> I'm just looking at it at a weird angle. I think because it's just you're not seeing the stomach. <laughs> yeah, just... Just like... Hey, pleasure seeing you again. Just I hope you're doing well. Don't pull hmm. any mean pranks on us. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I've set up a few little farms out here in sort of the natural thing. Lava farm, dripstone farm, that kind of thing. I should probably harvest this. But yeah, lava farm, mm. dripstone farm, and all that. And I also got my own nether portal set up down here. So, in case you ever want to delve deeper. Mm. Well, that's good to know. I would have to get the basics before I have ever <laughs> stepped foot in the nether. Oh uh, yeah, I know that feeling. Uh, mm. Would you like to tour the place that I've called home? Uh, oh my. This Obviously, is... I, I, honestly, I haven't done too much. It's only really the second floor that I've done anything for and the top floor. Just because it's way too big for one person to really fill up on their own. So, just been making do in a small area. <laughs> yep. Someone messed with this. This is a, a lot of steps. So, someone messed with these stairs. I don't know who. Hmm. I've seen places like this before. I always was curious what was inside, but I uh, was told that it was too dangerous for uh, uh, someone of my class to go in alone. Yeah, it, My retainers refused because, you know. Surprisingly, oh. it was empty when I came in besides for the building itself. Was so. that... Did, did you make that noise? Oh, sorry. I have these slippers. I have cat slippers on. Oh, <laughs> I see. Yeah, they, they they help scare some of the more explosive creatures that are around. Hmm, that makes sense. Uh, I did set up my own little enchanto over here in case you ever decide you need to do enchanting. Hmm. That's good to know. So... Hmm. Wasn't like that before, I don't think. Hmm? Uh, just nothing. I thought the the calcite used to be raw iron, I thought, but could have just been going crazy. I mean, things could have changed like they did with my home. Yeah, potentially. It just, it's just, I don't often explore the, the floors all that frequently, so hmm. it's just, I don't often pay attention all that often. 
like I am either down exploring one of the various places outside or I'm in my room, so... What? <laughs> yeah, I apologize, I didn't exactly uh, make this <laughs> most reversible. <laughs> Yeah, it's uh, an interesting staircase, to say the least. <laughs> I had to actually make all of the stairs, making it a little bit easier to traverse up and down, at the very least. Mm. Now, there's another way down over there if you just want a quick way to level 3, but haven't done anything to this particular floor. Yeah, I'm gonna preemptively go get it. I mean... Because you never know when you need to get somewhere. Yeah, I suppose that's true. <coughs> the only ones I really have quick access to is the base floor, the second floor, and the top floor. Hmm. Because, I mean, I haven't really done anything with these other floors. It's not... When you kind of live alone and just talk to yourself, it's kind of don't need more stuff to start talking to others. Hmm. That is understandable. Oh, goodness. Oh. All this walking is making me hungry. Yeah. <laughs> It's get fine. get, get have, quite the exercise routine, man. <laughs> mm hmm. Hmm. Reminds me of one of the uh, Elven Force Deer God statues. Hmm. Quite interesting. Now this is sort of our unceremonial game game and kitchen area, so to speak. <laughs> I don't really do my cooking down here, just because I have my own little kitchen upstairs in my room. Mm. Ah. Did a spirit just intrude into your brain? Must be enjoying playing their pranks. <laughs> Hold on, I have to AFK for a second. Oh, you need to answer the spirits on the other side. <laughs> yeah, well, I, I need to I need to sit and think for a little bit, you yeah, know? I'll let you uh, do that. I'll meet you upstairs, I suppose. Okay. Hey, hey, spirits, that is... That's our following after, be following after. Just know you guys are super special, awesome. So just be chill. Don't worry, everything will be right. Don't miss out on work or school or sleep or food or anything like that. Take care of yourselves and you'll do great. I should probably attend to some of my plants. Well, everything. Get okay, yeah, everything starting to fill up quite a bit. I 
might start trading melons and pumpkins to the villagers again. Oh, they would be appreciative. blocks and all that. Got all my different flowers and all that too. need to just spend 20 min 20 minutes or half a bell just taking everything and turning it into bone meal for a uh, bone box since they are a great or I can even use it for um like cal uh, for uh, marble and limestone since I have a decent amount of carbol cobble But let's see, I actually need to drop off this random junk that I got before. I do also have this map that I've been holding on to. An underground bastion map. I need to turn off view bobbing, I think. Um, bobbing, 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 bobbing. View Bobby B. Where is View Bobbing? I don't know where View Bobbing is. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Okay. 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 Uh, okay. I, uh, okay. I got your message a while back and decided to send some things I've made and found in my travels. I hope to find them useful and delicious. Please share any of them with any of your friends. Oh, okay. Uh, how? Oh. Okay. <laughs> Definitely want to um, send him a thank you note later. I. I mean, I knew he was around. Was not expecting that sudden surprise, though. So, and I can just. Just put these away. So that away and drop off the cobble. Cobbles here. So drop them in there. So I'm gonna loop up. I have to see where view bobbing is. Let's see. Details. Options. Uh, um. Let's see here. Options. 
Options, video settings, details. No, it's not in view Bobby. There it is. Oh, help. Are you up? Oh, yep. Hi. Hello. Uh, hello. Yeah, pro you probably hear me from the floor above. <laughs> Well, I heard murmuring, but that was about it. <laughs> oh, yeah, I was talking myself into the spirits. So, so where'd you go? I'm up a floor. You'll just have to keep going on your path. Oh, okay. This place is really interesting, though. Glad you appreciate this uh, place. Mm -hmm. uh, it's very intriguing. I would like <laughs> if the if I if I were in my old area, I would come visit this. Yeah, be quite nice to you know yeah. walk around, maybe sip some tea as you walk. Uh, one of my friends happened to be uh, popped in while I was uh, searching through my backpack for a few things, and they left us. They actually left me and us a couple of gifts. <laughs> Oh, there you go. Um, up on these little sections, those there are botany pots. So if you ever need need a various supplies or plants to decorate with, you can always just come up here and grab what you need. Oh. So, yeah, this one's mostly going to be like the foodie kind of area and like mm -hmm. usables. There's one for I think that one's over there for es like essences and stuff that I've been trying to tinker with a little bit. Um, hmm. over that way is trees, and the opposite corner is, like, sort of flowers and plants and that kind of thing. Hmm. I will try to keep that in mind. Yeah, this is the top floor. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I already... Apparently I already have that. The weird magics of the spirits knew that you would <laughs> always need it. <laughs> yeah, my room is down here. Which, you can, if you want to stay here and be nearby, free for you to claim any or multiple of these rooms. Yeah. Let me grab this. Uh, here, do you, you want an azalea bush or some cookies? Oh, sure. And this gave a lot of coal, so you, you can... Oh, I definitely need coal. Or I will need coal, I should say. I have been in desperate need of coal myself. Hmm. Um, but yeah, and here is just sort of my room. Oh, yeah, I did... I did place the stuff, haven't gone through yet. I would recommend not going into here, though. There's a... Thing that the spirit told me in case I ever want an adventure to use the use the share stone that's in here. Too nervous to actually see what's on the other side quite yet. Mm -hmm. um, Understandable. He just quickly puts some of this stuff away though. Let's mm. see here. Wait, actually, I should probably be separate barrel for all my notes and stuff. Hmm. Yeah, I may, I may, um, see about tooling the, the villa to be a home of sorts. Cause usually, usually that villa is for, like, a weekend trip. It, it's not really for living, living in. But I guess if that's what's been granted me, this is what I got. Here, um, hmm? for just a little something just for on your just for on your way i found this on my uh on my journey in case just to offer you a little bit of extra protection along your way copper ring yeah curious weird, it has a weird magic essence on it that sort of just helps protect you hmm thank you um let's see here so did you you said you're your last name was Sapphire, by chance? Mm-hmm. Here, I, f I feel like this could also be useful at some point. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I, I, I mean, it's spelled differently, but yes. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, fi- I mean, like, more just, like, symbolic introduction, so to speak. Mm-hmm. Um, here. And also, just, I have a couple of these as well. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I did, might as well. Um, definitely gonna replace the coal that I have with this one, since definitely need so much coal to for my various supplies and projects that I've been doing. Because mm-hmm. <laughs> you know, you would be surprised, to be quite honest, mm. how much of coal I've been through. Yeah, I will have to figure out. And what is I need to do here? Um, <laughs> no. Ob- oh. Obviously, oh, um, Donald, hmm? the first floor, though. <coughs> yeah, a little past this area, there's, I- I've been actually been setting up a few animal pens. Not much, to be hmm. honest. But it, if you need wool, milk, or anything like that, uh,. Okay, I was I was hoping you made it to the right floor. But yeah, just mm. over in the, that area down that way, uh, there's ah. a few pens. Probably 100 or 200 blocks that way. Mm-hmm. Didn't want to have them growing in the swamp. I don't think it would be very good for their diets. So. Oh, this is an intriguing place. Still curious as to what magic transported me, but that's what magic does. Yeah. Especially when when wielded by someone who does not know or someone who does. And they're purposefully doing it. Yeah, I I definitely know that it is very strange and I do know that how I got here is not under my full control, even though it's just sort of weird to think about it like that. Hmm. Oh, it, this would not be my first time where magic has uh, changed things for me. Yeah. No, this is the, the most it's, it's changed ever. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it rarely has it transported me to a place wholly unfamiliar. Yeah. Well, I've... Plenty of projects I'm working on. Obviously, you've stumbled <laughs> across me in the process of something very big. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> but soon, once this gets built up enough, I'll be able to start working on the villager trading hall, and you'll be able to come here and more easily trade with villagers. Hmm. Oh, I do. I, I, I may I test something on you? Of course. Because considering the magic has has done the thing that it does, yes. I want to see if my if my innate ability still works or not. Yeah. This may be a little cold. Yeah, I just took and off most, might hurt. most of my armor, so. Okay. Ooh, that is very cold. Burr. Didn't really do that much just because some of my mm-hmm. natural defenses are up, but still mm. took about a heart. Hmm. Yeah, it was never really for, uh, it, I never really honed it for a weapon. Yeah. You probably more, saw you know, me tuck lineage. my horns under my hair. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess we could go, or while well, you go do your thing, and I can gather some things to, you know. I mean, do you want to go on an adventure? I mean, I need I need to be able to uh, uh, protect myself. I have four and a half hearts. I ain't going nowhere. Come on. <laughs> Until like, no, I have to. I ha- I have to gather things. I have to Minecraft <laughs> before I can like go to into the dead. Would you like to trade with the villagers to be able to get a little bit stronger, so to speak? Well, I mean, technically, I was just go go mining. I mean, I could at least join you for mining for a little bit. Well, yeah, if you want to. I'm gonna go down here. Oh, the thing is, um, do you have dark vision? Yes. As a tiefling? Oh, okay. I, I, well, I'm not a tiefling. I, I, well, 
I'm half elf, half tiefling. I think I ah hair, mm-hmm, I, that I, makes I, sense. My heritage is a little bit wonky. I have. Um, I have the natural abilities of my elven heritage, it, though, hmm. and the looks of my tiefling heritage. Hmm. I mean, understandable. Here, let me grab my axe. From and I'm nowhere. No, I'm no one to judge, considering my own lineage. Most people would be like, "Oh, you're just dragonborn." It's like, eh, half dragon. You're a dragon, but Blooded not really a dragon. Elf. <laughs> I mean, technically, if I wanted to, I probably could tool my magic to uh, transform, but I wouldn't be that big, considering not full blood. Yeah, yeah the what? The one downside of having the ability to see in the dark is that the creatures of the night naturally just still pop in if you don't light it up. Mm-hmm. Well, I usually had retainers to do that with, do, do that for me when we went to exploring. Well, I'll at least keep an eye out to make sure nothing sneaks up behind us. Hmm. Now I just need to go find some iron. Well, there's some right there. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you say that, and you just walk right past it. I them. need to find some iron. Walk right past it. <laughs> I mean, there's plenty of copper you can use to gain some experience smelting in as well. Oh, <gasps> I'm not breaking it. Oh, are you not skilled enough? Apparently, I'm not skilled. Did I get a skill point? No, I don't have a skill point. Yeah. Okay. So it looks like you're gonna have to. So should I go mine some? Co can I can, mine? Can you mine copper? I can mine copper. So focus on smelting the copper then. Okay. Honestly, I kind of forgot about that. <laughs> <laughs> Look, my, when, I, when you're max, when you have max mighty, you kind of forget about what you can and can't do. <laughs> I was like, why isn't it dropping? Oh. <laughs> I need some more stone. What are you- oh. <laughs> Sorry, just grabbing more coal. Ouch. I did, Those poor uh, cat shoes. <laughs> they're cat slippers. They're fine. Where did you get those slippers, by the way? <laughs> they're sometimes just magically formed in the chests. Hmm. No, or my fr oh, or that my friend gave them to me. So, do you hear a creeper? No. Hmm. Those Maybe you I'm do need things. some iron. I can collect the iron for you. <laughs> no, I would like to do it myself. Fair you enough, know, fair get enough. some experience, get stronger. Dang, this is a giant and, vein of copper. Yeah. You'll be surprised how much copper is around here. So much copper. Yeah. Is it actually useful in this world? No, besides for building, but well, depending on what you want to use it for. Hmm. Uh, I mean, you can make some rails out of it, you can make rings, you can make a copper kiln. And copper traps and copper lanterns. Hmm. You could also make some decorative blocks out of it and some pipes as well, so I haven't really experimented too much with the pipes, so hmm. Would you like some wood to have on hand though? Uh yeah, I could take a little bit more. Are you? Okay, there you are. Oh, here, um, get some mangroves and some redwood. I'm going to need uh to find myself a backpack here soon. Yeah. Well, we can actually. Pockets probably... are so full. I can actually probably make you one. Oh. 
hearing footsteps, but I see nothing. Um, Curse there, these elven ears of mine. <laughs> I do think that there might be a creeper over this way. Hmm. But do be careful, some of them do blend into the, their environment quite well. Yeah, there's a way up that way if you want to go mm -hmm. higher, but... Not yet. <sighs> Though I might have to find a, a, a spot to... to smelt things. Yeah, I've, I'm planning on working on a super smelter eventually. <coughs> Was not expecting that. Yeah, I fell down gonna... into a pit. So, oh, like you? Wow. Okay, you fall down there, huh? Oh, what are you killing? Zombie. Oh, that sounded very intense for just killing a zombie. Just don't mind me. I'm just going to burrow in. Stick that there. There's plenty more copper and all that down here, but it might be a little bit too difficult to, for you to actually mine. My apologies. <laughs> I got good. pulled away for a second again. I was just trying to come back up the hole. I'm in a hole as well. I'm gonna try to use my uh, sixth senses, try to figure out where exactly you disappear to. <laughs> well, not that far away, but... Yeah, I don't, but I'm trying to I triangulate make... where you the heck... Oh, there you are. <laughs> Did I make another one? I'm gonna make another one. Two of them. Well, uh, seal it back in so nothing crawls in. Oh, got those gravels. <laughs> Here, I'm gonna pick up my. Excuse me. Ah, oh, I'm so spoiled. Crawl, crawl, crawl. <laughs> I'm I'm looking for uh there was a there was a magical item that my uh retainers got for me one day that I am so spoiled because I've used it and now I've, I keep looking for it and it's not there. It's where one can literally just uh look into your pack and there is a crafting table you can build with it. Oh yeah, ba backpack uh, the backpacks I made are able to do that as well. Oh, so the backpack okay, that makes sense. Yeah. I don't know why I'm carrying around a crafting table when my backpack can do that, but I just honestly use the crafting table storage <laughs> for extra storage. <coughs> well, once I get a backpack of some sort, I'm curious. Let me let me, let me look at the. Um... Excuse me, I'm pouring myself soda. <laughs> fair, 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 valid, valid. Let's see. Oh my goodness, this is tiny. Um. How do we make so, things? So I'm just looking by looking through your eyes for a moment by the power of the spirits, and I just look hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> How does it look when I hold this? Probably not that cool because I'm on my sides. I can't. You can't even you see it. You just moved your head. That was well, it. Because I'm holding this, which I don't think you can mm. see. Wait, no, I'm not wrong way. I think it's this way. Yeah. No, you got it the first time, I think. Unless. It's honestly, I don't know. <laughs> 
<laughs> Slight delay, to be honest. Mm hmm. As it as it be. As it do be. Mm hmm. Ah, here we go. So, how do you upgrade backpacks? Uh, so, do you want the in character explanation or the out of character explanation? Out of character, because, okay. uh. So, in character, they don't have one yet. To, okay, to so basically, question. there are different cosmetic things that you can do. Like, if you have a regular backpack, you can use some bones to make a cosmetic look like a wolf. Or if you have a uh, some soul sand and a wither skeleton skull, you make it, can make it so your the backpack gives you immunity to wither and stuff like that. So, hmm. oh, actually, have enough for the squid traveler backpack, which might be useful. But yeah, so basically, there's the looks of the backpack that you can change which get, would give you addition which may or may not give additional benefits or different looks and for uh specific i'm assuming storage upgrades you need to make uh specific like material tier upgrades with a smithing table so for example you would want to do an iron tier with a blank upgrade which you would need some leather some backpack tanks which are glass and iron and a chest and combine it with a with like a bunch of iron and you'll be able to get more mm. which I actually should probably make a note so if you want to fully upgrade it to um, netherite, you'll need four blank upgraded tiers, which you get from the base <coughs> of the, uh, thing. And you'll need to make two backpack tanks. Hmm. This will be interesting. I'm seeing all the, the different abilities Ooh, i might have to get one of those yeah I've, one of my f the two that i'm aiming for would be either the dragon traveler's backpack or the squid backpack currently what does the squid one do that allows you to breathe ah. underwater and night vision while being underwater so hmm. that that could be useful but the drag the dragon traveler would be quite useful as well so thanks to my. Uh... Oh, what does the dragon do? Thanks to my obsidian skull that I have, that uh, allows me to temporarily become immune to fire damage and hurt by fire. And when... so I was gonna go try and do the potentially the uh, what was it the Bla I think it's the blaze one where. Mm. I was thinking of getting the magma cube one. Yeah, the magma cube one is quite useful. Actually, mm -hmm. you actually I could make it right now for you, since I do have two lava buckets, magma cream, and the ability to make a backpack for you. I mean, that'd be nice. I I would owe you a little bit, yeah, a boon of some sort. We can certainly uh, go now if you desire. Well, I mean. I wait for my stuff. Oh, yeah. I had to get them XP so I can, you know. Yes. Get to very, sh get to much stronger. Yes. <coughs> yeah, a backpack is definitely in order, considering. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, it looks like you're in an ad time right now. Hmm? You're in ad time right now. Oh! It's ad time, no role play. The, I think the only other person that's potentially watching your stream would be Camp. <laughs> I mean, that's okay. Let's see. Unless it's you, but I don't know if it's you or not. <laughs> I don't. I don't think I count on my own streams, even though I'm previewing it. Because I'm also not previewing it on the website, I'm previewing it on uh, the stream manager. Yeah. 
Hold on. <coughs> Ooh. What you do now? Hmm? Oh, wait, no, this is just an ad. <laughs> I was like, oh. I saw, like, a graphic design thing. I'm like, wait, why are you in some type of graphic design thing? I mean, I would be. <laughs> but no. If anything, I'm going I'm to do the drawing thing again. That was fun. Yeah. And then I, I need to start drawing on Clip Studio Paint. Otherwise, I will never learn it. But I get discouraged, man. Don't get as to I can't help don't it. Don't get discouraged. <laughs> I can't help it because I well, I, one, I already know it's gonna happen. It's inevitable because the same thing happened when I got uh, my ta my iPad and started Procreate. But switching, oh, your art sucks until you get used to it again. <laughs> To everyone who's trying something new, you don't get good until you keep doing it. So, and you mm -hmm. have to work through the frustration and anger that you might feel. You gotta just get good. Mm -hmm. Or even well, though that sounds really art, bad, there's all, there's... you just gotta practice. <laughs> <laughs> well, it, when it comes to art, you have to get through the ugly stage, as I call yes. it, before you get to the good. Yeah, I... like technically all all paintings, drawings, and all that kind of stuff start with an ugly stage where yeah. it, it doesn't look the best. But you just gotta either power through it or I just, just it's not like the ad break stopped. <laughs> <laughs> and I just saw my face on your side. <laughs> Hello, welcome back. I have a point. I think you have two points. Yeah. Uh, um, depending on what you want to do, I'd recommend, I, I mean, want... obviously this is you, but in your own skill set, so this is just out of character things. Mining is usually the way to go in early on. Hmm, that's what I was thinking. Because if you click that I'll little, like, white square that's in the, the, so if you cl right click on mining, um, or the way, and there's a white square. I have to get right level here. six. Yeah. But I'll you can be see here when for you a while then. The cores, yeah. Yeah. You know, it's gonna be a, it's gonna be a while before I can mine, mine up. Uh, cause I'm level. Wait, you have to be level. What was it? Level. S yeah, be level six. Which so I got, what? Whoops, three levels left or wait, two one levels more level? Left. Cause you get two points every level up now. So. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. We uh the the uh, system has changed for the people outside watching and all that. So mm. every time you level up, you get two points instead of one. Oh, that's nice. Now, if only I can make tools out of copper. Uh, you can technically, but you have to make iron tools first, which is kind of dumb. Exactly. <laughs> it's, uh, it's it's so dumb. <laughs> okay. Oh, and I'll pick these uh, up. A, a, a voice in my head said, you just gotta mine enough coal and you'll be good. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. I guess I could go mine coal. Just the, uh... Oh, wait, the, I have to the, make the fo a... The, fo the fox whispers to me. ring a ding ding da ding da ding ding <laughs> Just shake my fox <laughs> shenanigans. <laughs> I need regular stone. This, the, the first stone time talking about who's is... watching is she will understand that joke, and I'm sure he'll tell me it's a dumb joke. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what's that? Hold on, what's this? Ooh, it's a it's a camp that someone left behind. <laughs> and, the, and the and the fox whispered yes. There are bones in Ooh, it. Mine just has paper. And look, I'll a take smoker. the bones. Yeah, sure. Why and not? a bed. Oh, I'll take the smoker. Oh, my bad. Ooh, 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 ooh. Gems, gemstones. <gasps> Jade. <gasps> the irony of getting Jade. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> to, to, to the to to the to both my viewers and to Star's viewers, I played a character named Jade in the Nova <laughs> SMP into the. 1.5 season of the no point five season of, of Nova, no, layman's yep. Nova. <laughs> I was a turtle. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they were a turtle. Oh, there's some coal. <coughs> oh no, I shall protect you, my liege. 
There is a hmm? zombie coming. Oh, there's a zombie. Okay. Hmm. Man, this does not do as good a damage as I would have liked it to. Also, but it looks cool, but I'll swap back to my claymore. It's a little bit tougher. <laughs> Oh, that is something. I will have to figure out what I want to do. For weapon-wise? Yeah. Like, what kind of weapon shall I wield? I mean, I, I trained in many of them, because, you know, as a noble, you kind of have to. <laughs> However, <laughs> it has been a while since I've done any of that. Yes. Since before then, I had retainers to fight for me. Oh, no! Nom, 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 nom. I need the XP. Stole it out there. I, no, I, I just, I just nibbled, <laughs> nibbled up the coal. <laughs> oh no, the the XP fell to the uh, ground because I wasn't close enough to it. Fortunately, uh, like I did. I need. Do you need more blocks? I need to put this down. No, I have my pickaxe. I have this one. I forgot. Oh I, well. To be fair, I would give um, you my diamond pickaxe, but I need you can't stone. use it quite yet. You know, I can't. I need regular cobblestone. I have regular cobblestone. And I have one. There you go. Just... I don't need- I have several barrels full, quite literally. So what does the copper kiln do? Uh, it specifically helps melt, uh, ores, I think, and... There's nothing- I- honestly, I only experimented with it a little bit, but it's like a specialty Thing, like the bl blast furnace or smoker I don't remember what ah. it's <coughs> I don't remember what it's specialty cooking thing is so mm -hmm. are you sure you don't want some of this iron for you if for yourself my liege <laughs> No, I'm I'm okay for now. It is quite nice though going on adventures. Haven't done this since. Oh, I heard another level <laughs> I was... up. Oh yes, I, I did level up. Thank you. Forgot. Uh, there we go. I can now mine my own art. Uh, my own urn. Urn. <laughs> I, there's just Come so here, much copper iron. around where, like, I don't even want to bother harvesting it anymore just because it's just so much of it. <laughs> Understandable. Literally, like, I, you saw the pit. I've been using wood and copper just to decorate the walls. Huh? Oh, where'd you go? <laughs> yeah, I've, I've been using copper and wood to decorate the walls of my thing. Mm hmm. Which you should be able to... Oh, I'm only level 30 in mining, but... Um... Once you hit level 10, you should be able to go into Deep Slate just fine. Actually, level 14 allows you to mine diamonds as well, so... 12 for Lapis, so... 14 if you want to be able to harvest everything that's un under the ground. Mm. Ten if you just want to harvest most things that are... Well, diamonds are a necessity, so... Yes. And considering... My, uh... What I'm a sovereign of... It, it would be remiss of me not to put anything in... Or not to... At least somewhat max out... Mining. I've only done mining out of necessity. I mean, I haven't done it since I was young, but that is what my uh, noble house is known for, which is metals and gemstones and things like that. My uh, knack happens to be uh, communication skills. Hmm. And trading and setting up events and that kind of thing. Well, there you go. So, try to normally avoid mining unless I have to. <laughs> it can be therapeutic. It definitely can, but when you're uh, when you're alone, it kind of gets draining. 
Oh, I, that's the best kind, the best time, in my opinion. Yeah. But that's just me. I mean, it's definitely but that, fun. But uh, that collect... rarely happens. <laughs> I mean, it definitely can oh. be fun to uh, collect various of resources and the like. But mm -hmm. and I always found it more fun to do with others, at least over time. Hmm. Yeah, no, I'm rarely alone. But when I was younger, before, you know... Coming of age to take to take the title and all that stuff. I could go, you know, mining by myself. There's not much up here. I thought there was more. <laughs> yeah, I mean, there's like some in the ceiling and stuff. Yeah, that's that's too much. Um. Okay, I'm gonna. So otherwise, I will die. <laughs> um. But yeah, no, it it is fun to explore alone sometimes. 